Okay, pet parents, a large number of you wanted more information on the gastropexy surgery, so let's talk about the procedure that can prevent a GDV. The word gastropexy can be broken down into two different parts. The first part is gastro or gastric, which most people are familiar with. It means stomach. The second part of the word pexy stems from the Greek word pexis, which means to fix in place or to fasten. So if we smush those two together, the word gastropexy means to fix the stomach in place. Now, how do we do that? That's an excellent question. So if we think of this bag here as a stomach, in my left hand, I have the entry point where food enters the stomach, and in my right hand, I have the exit point where everything leaves the stomach. What's happening with the GDV is this exit part essentially flips up and over the top part. And now this is just a hot tangled mess and nothing can get in or out. So with a gastropexy surgery, what we are doing is we are essentially taking the outside lining of the stomach and we're suturing it to the body wall so that this can't flip anymore. As another visual representation, I have this box. Oh God, what's, what's in the box? Come, what's in the box? It, a, a, a lemon, a lemon, it, it's a lemon. A lemon is in the box. Oh good, oh my God, Whew. I was wondering if that was gonna be something crazy like a head or something like that. Oh my God, that would have been awful. Now, if we think of this box as the abdominal cavity of a pet, and these are the ripped and chiseled abdominal muscles, if we take our scalpel blade and we cut straight down the middle of the belly, we can open it up and see the inside of the abdominal cavity where all the organs are hanging out. And this is the inside of the abdominal wall. Now, what we do with a gastropexy surgery is we take our stomach and we stick it to the in... We stick it to the in... We stick it to the inside of the abdominal wall so it can't move. There are a handful of different surgical techniques in terms of how we do the actual gastropexy surgery, but they all achieve the same goal, and that's suturing a part of the stomach to the inside of the abdominal wall. And this can either be done the old-fashioned way with a full abdominal exploratory surgery, or the more modern way laparoscopically, meaning we make small little incisions, and we go into those incisions with a camera, fancy tools, and we do the entire surgery while staring at a TV screen. Now, for the purposes of this video, I'm going to say that if done correctly, a gastropexy surgery will prevent a GDV from happening. In reality, Reality, there is an exceedingly small chance that even if done correctly, a pet can still develop a GDV after successful gastropexy. But you got a better chance of winning the Powerball than that happening.